My name is Maurice Samogola. I work for Minet Insurance Brokers. We do insurance, risk management, and uh, human capital consulting. The theme of this conference was uh, maximizing value retention, and the aspect of national content was very ably discussed through the various subsectors of the project, from the Tilenga project to the Kingfisher project, as well as today we are now tackling the eco or the pipeline. Now, risk is at the center of any transaction. Oil and gas has one of the highest risks in any business, and these are very highly priced projects. And from this, there's a requirement to mitigate risks at all levels. The client will work with Minet to understand its risk management, to understand the risks, to mitigate these risks through processes, to go through the engineering with qualified engineers so that risks are mitigated. When these risks are mitigated, the project is delivered on time, the project is able to serve Uganda in as far as uh, providing the requirements for the completed project. The loss is not suffered. The money is then retained through the retention that is done by those insurance companies. Of course, because of uh, aspects of balance sheet, they have to share these risks with other insurance companies in the world, companies which have solid balance sheets. These companies are found in the Lloyds of UK. These companies are found all over Europe. Uh, mentioned companies like Munich Re, mentioned companies like uh, Swiss Re, mentioned companies like Allianz, mentioned companies like AIG. The biggest challenge now that is now um, facing Uganda is that we are in the middle of an environmental crisis. Most uh, organizations in Europe would not want to see a bigger footprint in terms of development of fossil fuel. They would rather we go to green energy. So there will be much more pressure on the project developers to ensure the risks are mitigated so that at the end of the day we can deliver the projects in time and we can utilize this resource.